Okay. This will be an interesting one. We've done heaps of these, however. We've done heaps of them before. How big are we going to make it? 141.4. Going with a little contrast. Alright, let's see what we've got to put on the glass we got here Tajay Natural Forces oh here we go more marketing blah silly natural forces yeah right <laughs> that's typical of a big company like Tajay or Target I like to call it Tajay it's a bit of a fun with the name Target Tajay they do have some good big brands as well as their own in-house brand uh, but like any big company they're greedy like they've got self checkouts pretty much most of the checkouts are self checkouts they don't have there's not many people working on the as a checkout operator to do the job so basically yeah uh, <laughs> automations become a really a real big problem in the workforce too many people are being automated out of work and it's not nice being found without a job because a machine has taken over or a self-checkout which means a person does their own checkout uh, at these little kiosks uh, I don't approve of that I don't like using them myself and I try to boycott them as, with, as often as I can I try to boycott using them I just don't believe that people should be automated out of work uh, so we have to basically there's not enough work going around period and basically we have to basically keep as many people employed as possible so these automate but these automations you know they save money for the um, companies, that's what they're doing. They're being greedy. They're tightening their belt uh, at the cost of people's livelihoods. It's not fair. And then, of course, if that keeps happening, there won't be enough people who can afford to buy the objects. Of you know, They won't be able to afford to buy clothing or food. And then, of course, the big businesses are going to feel a pinch. They're going to wonder where the fucking sales are gone because people just can't afford anymore. And then, of course, that'll just accelerate the unemployment, you know, with especially so people just can't, uh, don't have the money to buy the product. So what's the point in, in automation when the customer's uh, buying power gets eroded because the customers themselves had lost their jobs due to the automation? Not fucking good. It's not, a, it's fucking stupid. But rich people are fucking stupid. They've got no fucking brains. Fuck me dead, they're so fucking dumb. These rich people like Tajay, I don't know who the fucking name of the Tajay CEO is. Uh, I think Target had its origins in the US. I think it's a US company or something. Because uh, they've got it in Tajay in they've got it in the USA. So but you know, it's just not right that we should lose uh, work. I know automation can be good. If automation was used only to uh, to automate jobs that are considered too dangerous or, or unsafe or unhealthy for humans, well, yeah, that's good. That's progress. But not getting rid of self, not getting rid of fucking checkout operators because they do their job and it's nice to have someone to talk to as well. And I think a lot of people would agree with it, but people are still you flocking to them, I guess, trying to get out quickly I don't know these stupid companies really honestly I don't have any respect for what can I say uh, so that's that one and that's this one 
Okay, that looks interesting. I think now we can call this Tajay demo quits.